Hey guys, for today's video, I'm going to show to you on how to derive approximately a function by the three popular methods of numerical differentiation. First, the forward, second is the backward, and third is the central difference. So first, let's go to the forward difference. So, on forward difference, I may formula na the derivative of the function of x is equals to the function of x plus delta x minus the function of x over the delta x. So, where the x, ito ay ang point of interest, which is given sa problem. And then the delta x is the step size, which is given then sa problem. So, para maintindihan natin lalo ang forward difference, let's have an example. The function of x is equal to 2e raised to 1.5 x. So, let's find the derivative of the function given na ang x is equal to 3. And then, ang step size natin, the delta x is equal to 0.1. So, since we all know na already the formula for the forward difference, the function of x less delta x minus the function of x over the delta x. So, substitute na lang natin yung mga given. So, the function of 3 is equal to the function of x which is 3 plus the delta x which is 0 0.1 minus the function of x which is ang x natin is 3. over the delta x which is 0 0.1 so 3 plus 0 0.1 that is 3.1 so hanapin natin ang function na ang x natin is 3.1 and then ganun din na ang, function, na ang x natin is 3 all over 0 0.1 so it's 2 e raised to 1.5 times x which is 3.1 minus 2e raised to 1.5 times 3 all over 0 0.1 so if we're going to calculate this the answer is 291.35 so this is the example for the forward difference So, since nahanap na natin ang approximate derivative ng ating function by using the forward difference, ngayon naman is gagamitin naman natin is ang backward backward difference. So, ang backward difference ay may formula na f of x minus the function of x minus the delta x all over delta x. So, ang x dito is ganun din kagaya sa ating forward which is the point of interest and then ang delta x natin using is the step size. So, for us to understand more the backward difference, Gamitin din natin ang same na, ang same na function kanina. Same given function. We have f of x is equal to 2e raised to 1.5x. So, hanapin din natin ang approximate derivative ng function using x as 3. And the step size is 0.1 again. 
So, backward difference, as we all know the formula. So, the function of the derivative of 3 is equal to the function of x, which is 3, minus the function of x, 3, minus the delta x, which is 0 0.1, all over the delta x, which is 0 0.1. So, 3 minus 0 0.1, that is equal to 2.9. So, hanapin natin ang value ng function at 3 and then ang value ng function at 2.9. So, 2e raised to 1.5 times 3 minus 2e raised to 1.5 times 2.9 all over 0 0.1 so by calculating this we get 250.77 so this is the approximate value of the function 2e raised to 1.5x given x natin is 3 and then and delta x natin is 0 0.1 so this is the approximate value 250.77so, since nahanap natin ang approximate derivative ng ating function sa forward and sa backward, let us now move on sa central. Central difference. Ang central difference ay may formula na approximation of f times x plus delta x minus the function of x minus delta x all over 2 times the delta x. So for us, para mas maintindihan ang central difference, solve na naman natin ang ating function kanina by using this or by using central difference. So the function of x is equal to 2 e raised to 1.5 times x. Since we all know na already the formula, hanapin natin ang the approximate derivative nito, given ang x is 3. And then, ang delta x natin is same pa din, 0 0.1. So, since we all know na already the formula, let's just substitute the given. The derivative, the function given 3 is equals to the function of 3 plus 0 0.1 minus the function of x which is 3 minus delta x which is 0 0.1 all over 2 times delta x which is 0 0.1. So, 3 plus 0 0.1 is 2.1 and 3 minus 0 0.1 is 2.9. So, hanapin natin ang value ng function at 3.1 and hanapin natin ang value ng function at 2.9. So, 2e raised to 1.5 times 3.1 minus 2e raised to 1.5 at 2.9 all over... 2 times 0 0.1 So by calculating this, we get the approximate value 271.07 So this is the approximate value using 
the central difference. So for us to get the true error, the true error, it is equal to the true value minus the approximation value. So ang true value ng ating function, f of x, is equal to 2e raised to 1.5x. So let us derive this, since we all know the derivation from at from our differential calculus class ng e raised to ax it is equals to a e raised to ax so the derivation of this function is equals to 1.5 times 2 e is to 1.5x so it is equal to 3 e raised to 1.5x. So let us now find the true value of this function by using x as 3. We get 3 e raised to 1.5 times 3. So by calculating this, we get the true value 270. 0.05 So as you can see ang true value ng ating function ay 270.5 which is pinakamalapit yan sa ating central value because ang ating forward difference ay may 291.35 ang ating backward naman is 250.77 at ang ating central naman ay 271.07 as you can see Ang ating true value is 270 which is nearer to our value from the central difference which is 271.07. So since nakuha na natin ang ating true value, hanapin na natin ang ating true error sa bawat um, methods na ating ginamit. So let us now find the true error sa bawat method na ating ginamit. So for the forward difference, ang ating true error is equals to true value 270.05. Minus the approximation value which is 291.35. So the true value for the forward difference is equal to negative 21.3. So for the backward difference naman, the true error is equal to 270. 0 0.05 minus the backward which is 250.07 so we get 19.28 that is for the backward so for the central naman Let's find the true error as to 270.05 minus central is 271.07. The true error is equal to so the true error is equal to negative 1.02. So as you can see. So let's have a recap now guys. So as you can see, ang ating numerical differentiation are my three methods, the forward, the backward, and the central difference. So those three methods ay naghahanap lang or ang pag-differentiate ng three methods ay ang paghahanap lang ng slope ng function. It is like rise over run. So as far as I can say that the central difference is ang pinaka-accurate 
kasi siya ang may pinakamalapit na value sa ating um, true value kasi nga ang central differential yung average ng dalawa which is ang forward at saka ng backward so since sa center siya so mas malapit ang approximate value niya sa ating actual value so that's all for and that's all for today guys. I hope na may natutunan at naintindihan kayo about sa akin tutorial sa numerical differentiation. Bye!